Two was actually founded by a group of scientists from Duke University and from Harvard University who have worked actually separately but at similar times on developing a removable tattooing. You know, it runs the gamut. Most people that I've talked to have been, you know, either excited or intrigued by the possibilities. Um, certainly there are the purists out there who see the permanence aspect as an intrinsic part of tattooing culture. Honestly, I think that part of the idea behind tattooing itself is just the, uh, really the tradition behind being tattooed, you know? It's not necessarily just coming in for a few laughs and getting some ink and having a good time. The real collectors of it, it's actually a lifestyle. And I think part of that lifestyle includes what it is you go through to get the art. So the concept of using some kind of a, even a painless technique, it defeats the purpose of what it was all about in the first place. Where I come from, at least some of the old guys that I came up around, if you had something on your body you didn't want, you got it covered, you know? It's the same concept as getting it put on. It hurts, and it's supposed to hurt. What you go through, it's a life-changing experience. Tattoos, to me, they're an expression of one's individuality. They kind of tell a story of, uh, at least mine do, of my life. Um, they'll tell you where, when, you know, how things were going in, at, at that time of your life. It's um, kind of a badge of honor, I guess. It's kind of a suit that it's worn all the time. Uh, personally, tattoos have always been a huge interest in my life. One of my uncles had a tattoo, and he was a biker-style guy. And I was probably 12 or 13, and I was like, God, I gotta get tattooed. They've marked portions of my life all throughout my life until this point. I can tell you where I was for each tattoo that I have, and why I got it, and you know, what my state of mind was at that particular time in my life, which I may have otherwise forgotten at this point. I think that some of the uh, people that will oppose this type of ink are the hardcore enthusiasts or the, th the tattoo artists that, that don't think that things should change. Everything changes. You know, life changes. Everything everything moves forward. Well, I'm, for me personally, I'm not into it. I mean, whatever floats your boat, go ahead and do it. I think if you're going to go through the process of getting a tattoo, you should, you know, plan on knowing that it's forever and that it's, you're going to keep it. Now I can see if you're planning on lasering off certain areas to make room for a bigger piece, putting something on you that you can just erase because you don't think it's cool anymore is pretty lame. I don't condone it and I wouldn't use that particular ink myself to tattoo onto people. I'm just not into it. It just gives another avenue. Uh, I, I think it's going to be um, a, a welcome addition to what we already do. My advice to anybody that is contemplating getting a tattoo, whether it's a temporary style one or a permanent tattoo, definitely research the place that you're going to get it. Get on the internet, find out what other people have to say about that studio and those people that work there. And as far as new stuff, like this new supposedly invisible or disappearing easily with one laser treatment, number one, kids, a laser treatment is not easy. It hurts like hell. Uh, number two, make a wise decision. I would wait a little while. Don't jump on a bandwagon of something that's brand new and hasn't been field tested. They're still poking holes in you and putting ink under your skin the same way we do. Is it a safer ink? Is it erase easier? Time's gonna tell. But um, at this point right now, be safe. Keep an open mind and keep your eye out for new options, new technologies. We estimate that we will have a limited release later in 2007. The Freedom 2 Immovable Ink, I, I think it's going to have a, a great place in the tattoo world, whether it'll be accepted by everybody or not. Do it or don't do it. Exactly. That's what I said. You want to get tattooed? Come get tattooed. You want to have something temporary? Go get henna. Do what that says. That's the last time, you know. Yeah, yeah. That's that.